In this question part, we have to write down the value of x bar and the value of y bar. In other words, the mean of the x values and the mean of the y values. We can easily solve this question by using our calculator. Of course, you can add up all the x values and divide the result by the number of x values, so 8, and then do the same for y. But there is a quicker method. Let's see this method. If you press STAT and edit, you will see that we still have our x and y values that we entered in question part A. Therefore, all we have to do is to go back to STAT, go over to CALC, and choose two variable statistics. Our x values are in list 1 and y values are in list 2, so we can just scroll down and press CALCULATE. On this screen, we get some statistical data about x and y, and as you can see, x bar, so the mean of the x values, is 15, and y bar, so the mean of the y values, is 11. If you would like to learn in a bit more detail what each number represents on this calculator screen, feel free to watch the Two Variable Statistics Calculator video, where I further explain this concept. Let's see two exam-taking tips that you can take away from here. The first one is a reminder that when a question begins with the common terms write down, you are not required to show any work. Here, for instance, we just used our calculator to find x bar and y bar, and simply wrote down what we saw on the calculator screen. The second tip is that when you are looking for the mean values for a two variable dataset, you can take a shortcut by using the two var stats function on your calculator. This is what we've done here instead of manually calculating the mean of the x values and the y values. This shortcut is especially helpful if you have already entered the x and y values into your calculator when solving an earlier question part.